Yo, what's up YouTube, it's your boy Jamal Labiade and welcome back for yet another YouTube video. Today we're gonna do something fun. We're gonna make another City Girls type beat. A City Girl party sample type beat. You should like this one, all right? But before we get into that, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Please subscribe, and when you subscribe, make sure you hit that notification bell right there. Dang, let's do it. And if you haven't heard, I just dropped a new sample kit, Pretty Girls Love Samples Volume 2. Look, 25 plus 90 samples already pre-cut and pre-chopped and all the effects on it just for you. It's drag and drop style. Just build the beat around it and it's ready to go, all right? Go check that out. The link will be in my bio. But look, enough of all that. Let's make a city girl type beat, a party beat, something we can have fun to, all right? Let's get it. Chill. All right, you guys, let's get into it. We're going to make a fun fun city girl type beat you know city girls always use samples uh like the twerker later even like lotto big lotto big energy well saucy santana uh the song his song booty has a crazy and love sample so the sample i'm gonna use today is freaky leak by pd pablo and i already got the sample downloaded so i just drag and dropped in there and this is a sample right here so i'm not going to even slow down and show you guys how to sample this i'm gonna have 100 sample videos just click below boom boom that's how you sample. This is just kind of teach you the steps of how to make a city girl type beat or like the elements within most city girl type beats. So let's get into it. So I'm hit the flex time. Cause now I just gotta pick some part I wanna loop. I know I wanna loop this first part. But on. And stop it right there. All right. And it's, it's, a, it's important picking the right sample, you guys. You wanna pick something fun, something nostalgic, 2000s era, something everyone knows. And this is just like something like that. All right, so I got the two parts I need, one right here and one right here. So I'm gonna do the control click, slice at flex markers, boom. I'm gonna bring this down here. And I'm gonna bring it down right here. And like I said, I have uh, sample tutorials you can go check out. I'm gonna bring this down right here. So the key part is having a, a sample that's catchy and fun. And this right here, boom. Let's make sure it loops perfectly. First thing I like to do is put a hi-hat. Hi-hat helps me keep the pace of the song, you know? Something fast, something fast and easy. Cause for these kind of beats, we're in the club right now. We're dancing, we want something fast. So let's do a hi-hat. I took out the highs and the lows a little bit so I can build more around the uh, sample. I'm gonna bring this EQ up on this so it can hit a little harder. I'm gonna go down here, note repeat. I'm gonna do some fancy stuff. Something like this. So I'm gonna put a clap to uh, kind of cover that clap up. Uh, let's put a snare in there, a little counter snare. Add a little bounce to this. So I'm gonna bring the kick in next, you guys. When you guys are making the kick, think about how you want the 808 weight to go because really the 808 weight kind of for these kind of beats kind of drive it home. So I'm kind of thinking how I want the 808 weight to go. So in my head is like boom, 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 boom. So the kick is probably gonna go something like that as well. So next I'm gonna find go to the 808 and find what note the 808s need to be in, honestly. Drag this down right here, boom. All right. Control A. Drag all the notes up to the root key, the root note. Boom, 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 boom. I got the 808s going. I think a whistle sound really good. Now I'm gonna add some fun sounds like it's it's real simple. We're just putting character into it. Beep beep. I've been doing this little beep beep thing for a long time. You guys can you guys can have that one, yo. Let's do a, let's do a zap because it needs some more stuff in here. Let's do a zap. And actually, let me go back. I'm probably going to have to change the 808s up a little bit because I've never changed the pitch. So what if we go to... All right, guys. Now I got the pitch where I want it to be. We have to change this 808 with the pitch, you guys. So we want the pitch and 808 to match. So... 
you guys you see it's off key just because we changed the pitch of the sample so let's find that see it's not hitting as hard at this pitch so let me see if i change it what if i go to low octave i think we figured out the 808 a little bit i don't know i might go back and change it up a little bit but i feel like that part is going to be my hook and we're going to tone it down for the the verse so i think for the the verse part this verse part right here i'm going to turn the eq bring the highs out a little bit i mean close it up a little bit just so it's just so i have a different in sound when it comes to the chorus and when it comes to the chorus i'm gonna let the highs back in right here let's see so I'm come in. i feel like we're on the road to make it a little city girl type beat I think I gotta do a fast clap. Uh, you know, a little fast clap for this part. Really bring it out. Let's see, let's see. The clap's hitting. No, it'll, it'll go crazy right here. It's a stump. Well, boom, boom, boom. Gotta let you know when we get into that part of the party, like, it's on. And you guys, it doesn't have to be complicated. It's, I mean, it looks like a lot of tracks, but it's not that many tracks. And you guys, I'm just teaching you the elements of how to make a city girl party type beat. You guys got to still make it your own, put drops in there, you know, mess with the, uh, take out um, hi-hats every once in a while, take out the claps, take out the snares every once in a while. What if I change, so I'm going to change the 808 for the verse, because I don't want to be too repetitive, so I'm going to change the sound of it. I'm not going to actually change the... I think this is good right now. I think this is good. I think we need to do something to make it different. I think a transition at the end will be dope. Like bump, 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 bump. Bump, 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 bump. I'm thinking do it again. Bump, 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 bump. Yo, that's gonna hit, man. It's really easy. You just gotta get creative with it, you guys. It's really easy. That's gonna be a mean stutter. All right, cool. But to help that transition out, I want to do two things. I wanna, I wanna put a, uh, a pouring lane on there right here. And I want to put a snare like. Kind of like the old school hip boy stare that. Let's do this. I'm just gonna play it and I'm gonna move the pitches later. So I'm going. I think it's gonna work like this. So start. I'm gonna start up here. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, dun, 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 So it be something simple like this, you guys. Just dun, 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 Switch out some like. And you guys, to make this more beat more instrument, you gotta make some drops or something. You gotta make some drops. Cause I'm just showing you guys the skeleton of how to make a beat like this. But you guys gotta get creative with it. You gotta have fun. Like right here, you can do a little uh, fade out. You know, do a little slow down with the fade out. Drag it up, boom, boom. So you do something like this. So yeah, you guys gotta get creative, have a little fade out. So something like, so it sounds something like this. And right here, let's put a yup in there, man. Let's put a, you know, that you gotta dunk, yup. You gotta dunk, yup. Let's put that yup in there. I, I, I think we're good. Like, I just gotta rearrange it how it needs to be rearranged. All right, you guys, so look. I hope you guys learned something. I went through it pretty quick, but look, 
City Girl type beat, you just want to get a good vibe. The sample I picked was nostalgic. Everybody knows that song. I keep my hi-hats moving fast. I keep the twerk claps. <laughs> Have the 808 sounds like it's a melody or a counter melody. That's a big deal. And just, I focus on the bounce. I have fun perks behind it. I have a whistle, a horn, a zap, pouring lean. And you want to do a little, a little switch up with the, um, want to do a little switch up with a breakdown. But besides that, let's get into this beat. Here we go. Whoa, whoa. Uh, whoa, whoa. One, two, three, here we go. Thank you for watching another Jamal Abiyade YouTube tutorial. That was how to make a city girl type beat. I hope you guys enjoyed it and learned something new. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And please subscribe and put that notification button on so you see the videos. Pretty Girls Love Samples Volume 2 is out right now. It's 25 plus samples for $9.99. Make sure you cop that. Link it below. And let me know what type beats you guys want to show you how to make, okay? Let's do that. Um, we're almost at 25K subscribers. So let's run it up. Tell a friend. Don't hide the sauce, man. Don't hide the sauce. Tell a friend. But until next time, I'll see you next week with another YouTube video, all right? Cheer.